have to, to be door. careful. We're all anxious Everything to find depends on you. Hopefully Kessler isn't a loon like Marcus was. Please, Stay focused out there, you hear? Anything worth anything in here? sense in wasting our time around here. The sooner we find Kessler, the sooner we'll get the hell out of here.
Harlo, I found Kessler's outpost. All right, find a way in. This place has seen better days. Good, there's an intercom. Dr. Kessler, you in there? Who is it? What do you want? My name's Perna, and I need your help. It won't take more than a couple of minutes. I am busy doing serious research here. I have no time for visitors. Leave me be. Sir, that's what I want to discuss with you. I, um, I read your study on Kuru disease. It was bloody brilliant. Uh, can we talk? I swear I can't get a moment's peace around here. Very well, come in. What's this here? Look at that. All right, I let you in. Now tell me what you want. I'm trying to reach Henderson and was told you know how to get there via the old war tunnels. There aren't any tunnels. Now get out of here. I am a scientist, not a tour guide. Stop wasting my time. Your pal Marcus Villa claimed otherwise. Wasn't he your research partner? You saw Marcus? I haven't seen him in ages. He was brilliant, you know, in his odd way. But let us just say there are reasons we no longer work together. Very good reasons. I'm not surprised. That crazy bastard tried to burn me alive. Said he wanted to eat my skin. He wanted to eat you? That doesn't make any sense. Sure, he went to live with the natives, but they've always struck me as peaceful people. Perhaps he was worse off than I even imagined. But that does not explain why he would resort to cannibalism. That crazy wanker claimed he was trying to find a cure for the plague and needed some flesh from someone who's immune. Wait a moment, are you saying that you are immune to what's happening out there? Well then, this certainly changes things, doesn't it? Yes, I'm afraid it does. Yeah, I have a map that you should find helpful. But if you want it, you need to help me with something. I have been researching this disease for many years now. Kuru has been endemic to the indigenous people here for centuries. This outbreak is one of many, and each incident is a little different, as is the trigger that reawakens the plague. It's truly remarkable how this prion disease adapts on changes, how it mutates when exposed to external factors, the speed at which it affects the host organism. Astonishing, really. But science can be unpredictable. Dangerous, even, you understand? Yeah. That explains the shit out in the greenhouse. A truly unfortunate accident. One that was largely the fault of my assistance. I assure you, I had very little to do with what happened out there. Look, I really don't give a shit either way. Just tell me what I need to do. I am merely trying to make it clear that I am not an evil man. In times such as these, it is easy for men of science to be blamed, persecuted for their actions especially by people who possess lesser minds. My four assistants were in possession of some reagents, chemicals contained within vials. Unfortunately, those vials are out there in the greenhouse. Bring them to me and I will give you the map. Do we have a deal? Okay. You will probably need to kill all four of them in order to secure the vials. But there is no saving them now. You will be putting them out of their misery. Just have the map ready. I cannot conduct my tests without the reagents. Do this task for me, and the map is yours. Thank you. 
Reagent is mine. I'm taking that. I'm taking that.
reagent is mine. That's the last one. I cannot conduct my tests without the reagents. Good, good. Now I can conduct my tests. I only require a sample of your blood. I'm about ready to give you a gobful, you lunatic. Give me the map. I am doing a poor job of explaining myself. You are clearly immune, that much is certain. But that does not mean that you are safe. There is a strong possibility that the virus is in your body. And if it is, it could mutate. And depending on how it mutates, you could be in grave danger. All I need is a small blood sample. I run a simple test and then we'll know. This is for your own good. Okay, do it. Okay, you will feel a little prick. Nothing to worry about. Do this task for me and the map is yours. See, that wasn't so bad, was it? If I had a little sweet, I would give you one. And I'd shove it up your ass. I was merely trying to lighten the mood. Oh, it will only take a moment to prepare the sample. Please be patient. This is truly astonishing. I've got your results. You are completely resistant to the virus. <laughs> you think I didn't know that? No, it is not what you think. Your resistance to the virus has kept it from multiplying, from wreaking havoc on your body. But it has not destroyed the virus. It has merely suppressed it. You need to be very careful. Any contact with certain types of reagents could trigger a mutation. And if the virus mutates, it stands to reason that you could lose your immunity. Or much, much, much worse. Unfortunately, there are so many factors to consider that it is impossible for me to tell you exactly what might happen. But one thing is clear. You should avoid anything that would put you at risk. Like what? Your plan was to use the tunnels to reach Henderson, correct? Yes, the Japanese created them during World War II and later they were used to store chemical weapons. In the 50s, during a monsoon, there was a leak, and some of those chemicals worked their way into the water. The Aussies sent in a battalion of engineers and soldiers to clean them up, but they weren't successful. When they went into the tunnels, one of them must have been infected. The virus mutated and all hell broke loose. The Aussies had to blow the entrances to prevent the infection from spreading. Most of the men were still down in the tunnels. I have long suspected that exposure to those chemicals is what caused the infected soldier to mutate. Anyway, you need to find the old Jesuit mission. A passageway runs from the ruins down into the tunnels. Here is the map, as I promised. I cannot stop you from going down there. That is your decision. But if you do, use an abundance of caution. Try to avoid prolonged exposure to the chemicals. I wish you best of luck. Thanks, Kessler. Hello, you there? Thank God I was starting to worry. Did you get the map from Kessler? Yeah, I got it. Might be a bitch going through the tunnels, though. You can fill me in when we meet up. Where are you going now? I need to find the entrance to the tunnels. We must investigate it for your own good, and for the good of mankind. How can I help you? We need more data for my research if I'm going to be able to help you. If you're heading to the tunnels, please be observant. 
Bring me whatever unusual you find there, will you? I'll do what I can. Excellent. There might be a strange substance or, or a monster that you have not seen before. Maybe some trace from the Australian force. 